Yo, what is going on YouTube? This is your boy The Vintage. Back with another video, man, as you can see right here, we have two pair of Air Jordan 6 Gatorades. I got a lot of hate from the video where I was like, is my shoes legit or not? I was asking a question. I was trying to get a discussion going in the comment section below about the stock X and Shine with a spoon situation. And I didn't turn off on you. This is not this is not what we're talking about today. Today I'll be talking about some of the sneakers that I need before I can call myself a sneaker collector or a sneaker head, you know what I'm saying? So if you're new to the channel, make sure you subscribe, ring the notification bell for your boy, and hit that thumbs up. We're gonna get right into the video. Let's get it. Okay, I'm gonna keep these shoes right here uh, just because I'm trying to do a little more research or whatever. Uh, like I said, I don't think my shoes are fake or anything. I just want to come up here and talk to y'all about some some shit that don't make sense. You know what I'm saying? I want to pitch this video professionally and uh, educated. You know what I'm saying? But the first shoe on the list is the Air Jordan 1 Braids. I need this colorway. I put a picture up here. Maybe not. I don't know. But everybody know what the Air Jordan 1 Braids are. Uh, I need them. I need the 2016 pair. The price is just... It's just too high, and it's a lot of stuff coming out, and I don't want to be behind the power curve. I want to cop what's, you know what I'm saying, current, uh, and something I can talk to my subscribers about. Uh, I got a YouTube channel, talk about shoes and shit like that, so it's kind of best if I stay up to date with the sneaker releases. Uh, but this is the shoe that I need, there's no one braids. And on StockX, man, I know I'm getting off, off topic, but it's kind of on topic. I'm following 99 pair of shoes that I need to add to the sneaker collection, man. 99 pair on StockX. Um, before, I was like, ah, oh, should I buy from StockX or not? Just over this whole situation. And um, I feel like by the end of the video I do with this, it will clear up StockX and it will clear up my pair of shoes. Um, but yeah, you know on StockX you can follow shoes and I am following whole ass Hold on, where is that? Yeah, I'm following a whole ass of shoes, you can see. Look at all them shoes that I'm following that I need, man. Oh, there's more down there. 99 pair. Uh, and I'm going to get them eventually. But it's just so much stuff dropping to where I just feel like I should wait. But the Air One Breads is a fucking must-have in your collection, man. Must-have. Uh, going down the list right here. Let me see what else we got. Air Jordan 1 5 Grapes. I got the black pair, but I feel like you need, or I need, let me talk for myself. This is for me to my subscribers. I feel like I need the Air Jordan 5 Grapes, the white pair. You know, I got the black pair. I picked them up recently. That's another pair. What else do we got here? Air Jordan 5 Fire Reds with the black tongue. I feel like I need that fucking pair. Like, that's an OG. Like, that colorway is just, just so dope, man. I remember it releasing back when I was in high school. And uh, I wish I could have copped it then. But, like I said, I might be able to use StockX to get my shoes from here on out. After I clear them up, you know what I'm saying? Another shoe that I feel like I need uh, is the Air Foam Posit Eggplants. I need the eggplants in my collection. Y'all know I have a whole bunch of foam posits over there. I have over maybe like more than 10 pairs. Y'all see my sneaker, uh, my Air Foam Posit collection. It's, just, it's crazy. Just adding up all the money you spend on foam posits is just ridiculous, man. The extra $60 over the resale of Jordans, I don't know, man. They need to drop the price on all shoes. That's just my opinion, but they don't give a fuck what I feel. Uh, the Air Jordan 7 Raptors. I need the Raptor colorway. Uh, recent 2012, I believe. Yeah, 2012. Uh, I want that pair. Just a dope colorway. And uh, maybe get me a Raptors jersey. I don't know if I can get a Raptors jersey until, you know what I'm saying, my Cleveland boys go ahead and sweep them out the playoffs, you know what I'm saying. Um, quick note, quick side note. I am going to be starting uh, like a sports analyst youtube channel man it's gonna be dope it's gonna be lit i'm gonna start from ground up you feel me hopefully some of my subscribers can go over there and support that uh but that's just in the works right now i'm working all the naming and all the logos and stuff like that so y'all stay tuned for that man uh back to this video the air jordan 4 military blues oh my bro this colorway is so dope my boy director whiskey shout out to you for giving me this pair of sixes them shoes are just so clean. Like, it's just something about that colorway that just, I don't know, it's just like, ah, oh, buy me right now, buy me right now. Uh, but I want to go through StockX. But before I go through StockX, like I said, we got to get down to the nitty gritty about the situation. 
Um, another colorway, Air Jordan 1 UNCs. Bruh, I remember I could've got this pair for $200. I'm looking at it right now. They're going for $284. $84 over the price I could've got them. I didn't jump on it. I should've jumped on it. If they gonna keep rising because this colorway is not gonna release for a long time. You know, they got the uh, off-whites dropping this colorway. And uh, yeah, man, y'all know what the UNCs are. Y'all know how they coming, man. I know how they coming. I need them. Another colorway. Uh, I don't know if I want the Mars Blackman, you know, with the Spike Lee's face on the side, or the regular Fire Red 4s. I need one of those colors. I feel like the Fire Red 4s is probably a more, uh, maybe something I feel like I need more than the Mars Blackman or whatever. But uh, I either want these, uh, yeah, I want these over the other ones. Let me pull them up real quick as you can see. Here's one for Fire Reds. Y'all know how they come. I want to add them to the collection before I call myself a sneakerhead. And the Air Jordan 8 playoffs, man. Like, it's so many shoes that I need, bro, that I have not got yet. It's just because so much stuff has been dropping. So much stuff. Uh, we got them. What else we got right here, man? Y'all already know what I'm going to say. Air Jordan 4 Black Cements. As y'all can see, man, very dope colorway. I need those as well. I believe they were, those are re-releasing All-Star Weekend next year. It's already confirmed and shit like that. Uh, yeah, I need those as well. Another thing that I'm thinking about is the Air Jordan 11 Concords, which are releasing. Uh, I'm going to cop a pair because it's like a million pairs in production or whatever. I'm going to cop them, so that's I'm not even put that on the list. And the Air Jordan 4 Thunders, oh my goodness. These are fucking sick, bro. I need these as well. I got the 14 Thunders, but I need these 4s. Dope-ass colorway. I remember them were releasing too when I was in high school. Uh, what's another pair? Air Jordan 9 Cool Grace. I feel like that's a dope ass colorway. Not needed in the collection, man. Check them out. Uh, Air Jordan Six Infrareds. Them shits is just crazy. You know, you know how these just come in. Uh, these released when I was in high school. Yeah, 2014. Yeah, I graduated, and uh, I need them, man. Very dope kick. Very dope colorway. And I need the UNCs as well. Y'all know what them looking like as well. Air Jordan Eleven Gammas. I like these way better than these Blackout 11s or whatever they have in, coming out at the end of this month. But I need this pair. I need the Gammas. Toro Bravo. Look, just look at all these shoes that I'm talking about. It's just a long video. I can keep going on and on. But I want to cap it off with one more sneaker before I end the video. This is the last shoe I feel like I need before I call myself a collector or a sneakerhead. Uh, and it is Air Jordan 1 Shattered Backboards. Just look at that price they're asking for. Just... I'm not gonna get them for a while, or I might can trade up to them or whatever. But right now, I'm trying to add more sneakers to my collection, and I ain't trying to trade nothing. I'm not trying to sell anything. So this is another pair that I want, but they're going for a thousand dollars, bro. Just crazy, just fucking crazy. It's not gonna come in the collection for a while, but uh, yeah, this is the last shoe that I need before I can call myself a sneaker collector. <laughs> Okay guys, that is it for this video. If you have not checked out the review and all feet over the Air Jordan 3 Katrinas, make sure I go check them out. Just check them bad boys out. Very clean sneaker. Um, yeah, just check out the review and I'm gonna give you my honest thoughts and uh, give you that dope on feet. So make sure I go check that out. Y'all know how to go check it out. Click on my name, go to my videos, and it should be the last video before this one. Um, also, this video should be dropping very, very soon. But like I said, I need to be, be more educated. Uh, pitch what I need to pitch in the right way and I don't want to make it a long ass video uh, but that's it for this video make sure you subscribe ring the notification bell for your boy follow me on Instagram and on Snapchat and I'm going to catch y'all in the next video peace